All right, guys, I'm out here at the Daniel Lady Farm in Gettysburg. Um, they got a reenactment today going on of the Battle of Antietam. I thought we'd bring you guys along to see some of this. I'm actually set up today, too, behind me here with some of my finds and some of my Civil War items. I just purchased a gun today I want to show everybody. Um, we got a tent here. Got a Civil War soldier reenacting here. He's asleep. All right, guys, here's the gun. Um, this was found and uh, the retreat route from Gettysburg. This was recently found about three weeks ago in a foundation of a home being tore down. I wanted to show that to everybody. This is a Model 1824 Springfield. You can see the U.S. Moore. Um, it was converted from a, a musket, flintlock musket. And it was converted to percussion for the Civil War. The soldier has his initials in it here. Somebody did. Um, pretty cool and it's broke here who knows what the story is on that but it's an awesome piece of history so yeah some of my finds so we're gonna walk around here and uh, check out some of the history here got a little bit of tent set up some living history and I figured you guys would enjoy this today so we're gonna get going here and we'll be back to you here in a little bit all right guys I wanted to show you this this is what a typical Civil War shelter would it look like for a soldier. Here's their cup. You know, you got your playing cards or keep yourself busy while you're out here with don't want to get bored. You know, you just basically got like a little shelter here. You know, campfire, you got a place to cook your food. And you got your blankets in there, you got your bayonet, canteen. It's pretty cool. And it's all you would need. And just laid in there and would sleep. All right, let's go check out some other things, guys. All right. All right, I am walking back here to where they have more of the tents set up, and they're doing some artillery demonstrations back here. Some of the Civil War uh, artillery, the cannons. I hear them going off occasionally, so I'd like to go back and check that out for you guys. I wanted to bring you along, so it's hot out here today. <laughs> Here we are in the middle of September and it's still 85 degrees out. All right, guys, we'll get back to you soon. Here we looks like we got a Confederate camp location here. You see the Confederate flag there. Got some more tents over that way. Beautiful day out here today, guys. Look at that sky. Like I said, it's hot. Got some more stuff back here we're gonna go check out. All right, I'll bring you along. Shooting some muskets off over here. I'll kind of give you an idea of what a typical Civil War campsite would look like too here. An encampment. Get your firewood. You got your tent set up. It's like going back in time. <laughs> it's cool. They were firing off the guns. Isn't that cool? I don't care how many friends you have. Wow. I said they better be. Alright, we'll get back to you. Alright, guys. This is what a typical <laughs> officer's tent would have looked like. You know, a little nicer conditions than uh, some of the regular soldiers. They have the small tents. So I'll give you an idea how big it is in here. Yeah, so I can stand up here and it's hot. Imagine trying to sleep in here at night. Whew. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's what it will look like. So you got the hat and uniform. It's pretty cool. Paperwork, probably some battle plans, who knows. All right. All right, we'll get back to you guys in a little bit. All right, thought you'd enjoy that.
Jack was saying it was from the... Alright guys, we got some uh, Civil War period music going on here at the Daniel Lady Farm. The house is behind me. Um, so, we're going to keep checking this out. You probably can hear some cannon fire in the background. Wow. Alright, let's keep going here.